how in 1975, India, with the help of Soviet Union then, the USSR, launched the Aryabhatta satellite. That was a heavy uh, satellite, but it was launched uh, by the Soviet Union for us. So that was the first ever attempt by India's ISRO to position something in the space, to enter the space itself. But after that, if you look at this spectacular journey that the ISRO has had, this success of Chandrayaan-3 is certainly going to have a very big impact on India's industrial and technological ecosystem. It's going to directly, of course, affect positively the satellite systems area, telecommunications area, and there are very many other related fields, all of which will benefit from it. Although in 75, we needed the Soviet Union's help to launch our Aryabhatta, a space uh, station to go into the space for the first time from India. Today, as of July 23, our record is such that we've already launched 431 foreign satellites for other countries. That is, 34 different countries have utilized ISRO's facility and their knowledge systems to launch their satellites. And I'm just recalling in 1975, our Aryabhatta being launched by Soviet Union for us today, but we are in a position to launch 34 different countries' satellites, but totaling to 431. What a spectacular journey this is for ISRO. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.